do 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 it's Monkey Mania. Welcome everyone to Monkey Mania here at TRDQ. Throughout the month of May we'll be looking almost exclusively at toys from my monkey shelf, a ton of Rise of the Beast Optimus Primal garbage and more. To celebrate I'm promising to produce one less video this month each time someone tells me in the comments that gorillas aren't monkeys. Just joking, I, I would never give my audience that much power. Or respect. The Optimus Primal Transforming Roleplay Mask is one of the weirdest items that Hasbro has produced in years. A techno-organic gorilla mask that transforms into the robot mode of Optimus Primal. Now for me, being such a big fan of both gorillas and Optimus Primal, I needed to have it. But I can definitely understand someone like you looking down your nose at something like this. You know, you know what you can be like sometimes. I mean, you're a lot of things, but open-minded? Immediately the mask feels very dense. This isn't like a thin plastic Halloween mask. It's weighty, it's solid, and we've got a ton of nice detail, including some patches of brown hair, two nostrils that are very satisfying to poke your fingers into, as well as this sweet maximal symbol. I think they've done a good job with it. Turning it round, you see pretty much what's going on for the transformation, and there he is, Optimus Primal all cooped up and cosy. We've got a nice soft plate to rest your nose against, and this very generous elastic strap. I say generous as this even manages to accommodate my big melon head. It's definitely still a toy mask for children. Don't expect this to be your Halloween costume this year if you're an old man like me, but it doesn't fit terribly. My beard does poke out of the bottom though to complete the gorilla look, which is very welcome. Putting it on, I was immediately struck by how comfortable it was. Considering all these lumpy robot parts inside, the sculpt and the thickness of it means that your peripheral vision is pretty much gone, but if you tackle all challenges head on, there shouldn't be a problem. A bit of life advice with your toy reviews today. If you put your glasses over the top, it makes you feel a little bit like the Riddler from the last Batman film. Transforming the mask isn't too difficult. There are six tabs around the mask you have to undo, and then fold everything out. The arms come down, the legs swing around, and that lets you shimmy those feet out and the whole chest spins around, letting you flip the head out before clicking the chest into the torso. And the elastic strap dangles loosely beneath the chest like a badly fitting bra, which must be awful for his posture. Now we'd all expect this toy to be the absolute pits, wouldn't we? You might expect something that's overpriced, it's flimsy, cheap feeling, but honestly, it's maybe not the best incarnation of Optimus Primal we've seen, and it is a little bit overpriced, but it's solid, it's balanced, it's poseable for something that you wear on your face. You plonk him down, he stands up. That's already better than a ton of movie toys we've seen in the last decade or two. Tight joints, a fun face sculpt, it's good. And there's an opportunity for theatre of the mind stuff too, with these wings at the back. Of course the nostrils, they can become boosters. Imagination stations everyone. And the legs are a bit hollow, sure, but this thing turns into a gorilla mask. How unreasonable are you being right now? This is a wonderful toy, you know, if I was nitpicking, and being like my audience, that is fickle and unreasonable, I would have liked there have been some kind of jaw hinge so you can open the mouth up when you're talking, perhaps making some gorilla noises or primal quotes. I mean, look at this great Godzilla mask, you know? But then again, this doesn't transform into anything, so we're, we're never happy, are we? Maybe if we all buy this mask, they'll make some kind of deluxe one with lights and sounds. Yeah, yeah, definitely buy this mask as an investment in the future, okay, bye.